Now this, guns, ammo, even a homemade silencer allegedly seized from an Edmond home where a couple was reportedly shot to death by their son. Today, we've learned homemade explosives were also discovered by police. News 9's Clayton Cummins explains how that discovery was made. Since last week's double homicide in Edmond, police here have been very hard at work combing through everything taken from the suspect's home. Homemade explosives were found in a place very unexpected. Police were called to this home on the 2600 block of Bryant Avenue early March 4th. 19-year-old Michael Walker was arrested after allegedly shooting and killing his mother and father, Rachel and Michael Walker. The 19-year-old admitting to police they were sending him messages telepathically throughout our investigation that day removed many pieces of property that could be evidence and things that we needed to look into further among the evidence police discovered four homemade explosives inside a first aid kit for safety reasons the home and its 10 acres were searched by Edmond police and OHP it's unclear what was taken they have multiple bomb dogs that can help us walk the property just make sure there isn't anything that we've missed and so that the family is safe as they're going through the belongings in the house. In a statement, Walker's attorney says he's acutely paranoid and delusional and believes that explains the horrible tragedy. Family says Walker has suffered from severe mental illness. Police continue to process the case. Of course, as soon as we have any new information, we will pass it along to you. In the meantime, funeral services for Rachel and Michael Walker are being held here in Edmond at Life Church. Services are scheduled to get underway at 3 o'clock. Reporting in Edmond, Clayton Cummins, Oklahoma's own News 9.